Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. Today we are going to learn and write 4th class Mass Magic Workbook Semester 3 Chapter Fractions. Worksheet number 13 Subtopic Comparison of Like Fractions. First question N circle the smallest fraction. A 7 by 8, 3 by 8, 1 by 8, 5 by 8, 8 by 8. Observe these fractions. Numerators are different but denominators are same. So these fractions are like fractions. Which fraction have smallest numerator is smallest than other fraction? So 1 by 8 is the smallest fraction. B 1 by 9, 5 by 9, 7 by 9, 3 by 9, 9 by 9. So here also 1 by 9 is the smallest fraction. Next to C, 15 by 17, 3 by 17, 6 by 17, 4 by 17, 8 by 17. Which fraction have smallest numerator here? 3. So 3 by 17 is the smallest fraction. Next to D, 6 by 12, 1 by 12, 3 by 12, 7 by 12, 11 by 12. Here also, which fraction have smallest numerator? 1. So 1 by 12 is the smallest fraction here. Next question. N circle the greatest fraction. A. 3 by 5, 4 by 5, 1 by 5, 2 by 5, 5 by 5. Observe here once again. Which fraction have greatest numerator? That is the biggest fraction here. So... 5 by 5 is the greatest fraction. Next B. 17 by 21, 5 by 21, 20 by 21, 10 by 21, 2 by 21. Here also denominators are same. So which fraction have biggest numerator is greatest fraction. So 20 by 21 is the greatest fraction here. Next question. Share the following figures as per the given fractions and then compare. Yes, A, 2 by 6. Here we have to share 2 circles out of 6 circles. Here, 5 by 6, we have to share 5 circles out of 6 circles. So, 2 by 6 is less than 5 by 6. Next B, 4 by 8. We have to share 4 squares out of 8 squares. Here 2 by 8. We have to share 2 squares out of 8 squares. When we comparing 2 fractions here, 4 by 8 is greater than 2 by 8. Next to C, we have to share 3 squares out of 9 squares. Here we have to share 8 squares out of 9 squares. When we comparing these two fractions, 3 by 9 is less than 8 by 9. Next worksheet number 14, subtopic fractions word problems. First question, from a 5 by 9 long piece of ribbon, a piece of length 2 by 9 was cut off. What was the length of the remaining ribbon? So total length of ribbon is 5 by 9. So length of cut off ribbon was 2 by 9. Length of the remaining ribbon was 5 by 9 minus 2 by 9. That is equal to denominator are same. 9. So 5 minus 2 that equal to 3 by 9. Next question. Kishore ate 9 by 10 of a pizza and Adi ate 6 by 10 of another pizza of same size. Who ate more and by how much? Kishore ate of a pizza equal to 9 by 10. Adi ate another pizza was 6 by 10. Here Kishore ate more pizza. More pizza eaten by Kishore was that equal to 9 by 10 minus Adi ate another pizza was 6 by 10. That equal to denominator are same. Numerators are 
9 minus 6 that equal to 3 by 10. Next question. Balu travelled 2 by 11 part of his journey on the first day. 4 by 11 part on the second day. And 3 by 11 part on the third day. How much part of the journey did Balu cover in 3 days? Balu travelled on the first day equal to 2 by 11. He travelled on the second day equal to 4 by 11. He travelled on the third day equal to 3 by 11. Balu covered his journey in 3 days equal to Two by eleven plus four by eleven plus three by eleven. That equal to denominators are same. Denominator is eleven. So two plus four plus three. That equal to nine by eleven. Next question. Madhulata used 3 by 10 of a meter lace for her apron and 5 by 10 of a meter for her dress. How much part of lace did she use in all? Madhulata used length of lace for her apron equal to 3 by 10. Madhulata used length of lace for her apron equal to 3 by 10 meters. And she used length of lace for her dress equal to 5 by 10 meters. So Madhulata used total length of lace equal to 3 by 10 meters plus 5 by 10 meters. That equal to denominators are same 10. So 3 plus 5 that equal to 8 by 10. Next question. Jamal ate 3 by 7 of a cake in the morning and 2 by 7 of the cake in the evening. How much part of the cake did he eat in all? Cake eaten by Jamal in the morning is equal to 3 by 7. Cake eaten by Jamal in the evening equal to 2 by 7. Total cake eaten by Jamal equal to 3 by 7 plus 2 by 7 that equal to denominators are 7 numerators are 3 plus 2 that is equal to 3 plus 2 5 by 7 so total cake eaten by Jamal equal to 5 by 7 next to worksheet subtopic assessment First question, shade half of each picture given below. Second question, color 3 by 4 of each of the following picture. Here we have to shade 3 by 4 of this half circle. Next to third question, write the fractions for the shaded parts in the following pictures. This rectangle has divided into 4 equal parts. Shaded part is 1. So 1 by total parts are 4. Here also shared part is 1, total parts are 4, 1 by 4. Here this triangle also divided into 4 equal parts, shaded part is 1, total parts are 4, 1 by 4. Next question, complete the table with suitable answers. Fraction, numerator, denominator, fraction in words. 1 by 4, numerator is 1, denominator is 4. So fraction in words 1 fourth next 4 by 5 numerator is 4 denominator is 5 fraction in words is 4 fifth next to 6 by 9 numerator is 6 denominator is 9 fraction in words 6 ninth next question complete the following table in words fraction 5 by 9 so 5 ninth, 1 fourth, 1 by 4. Next fraction is 3 by 5, so 3 fifth.
Next, fraction inverse is 2 sevenths. Fraction is 2 by 7. Next, 2 ninths. Fraction is 2 by 9. Fraction is 7 by 6. That equal to inverse is 7 sixth. Next to 5 sixteenths. So 5 by 16 is fraction. Next to fraction is 4 by 13. Inverse 4 thirteenth. Next question. The sum of one quarter and three fourths make k whole. Next question. What is the half of 40? 40 by 2 that is equal to 20. Next question. In a classroom there are 40 students. Out of them 30 are boys. What is the fraction denoted by boys in the class? So that is equal to 30 by 40. Next question. Identify and write the unit fractions of the following. 1 by 5, 3 by 7, 2 by 5, 1 by 8, 1 by 4, 5 by 7, 1 by 7. Fraction with numerator 1 are called unit fraction. So 1 by 5 is unit fraction. 1 by 8, 1 by 4 and 1 by 7. So these are unit fractions. Next to B also 1 by 9, 1 by 19, 1 by 11 and 1 by 6 are unit fractions. Next question. Arrange the following fractions in ascending and descending order. Let's observe here. These are unit fractions. So which fraction have biggest denominator that is smallest fraction. So here 1 by 13 is the smallest fraction. After that 1 by 8. After that 1 by 7. 1 by 6, 1 by 5 and 1 by 2. This is ascending order. And descending order is 1 by 2, 1 by 5, 1 by 6, 1 by 7, 1 by 8 and 1 by 13. Next to B, here also biggest numerator is smallest fraction. So 1 by 19 is the smallest fraction. After that 1 by 15, next 1 by 12, 1 by 5, 1 by 4 and 1 by 3. Descending order is 1 by 3, 1 by 4, 1 by 5, 1 by 12, 1 by 15 and 1 by 19. Next question, write the correct symbol greater than or less than in the given boxes. Here these fractions are like fractions. So which fraction have smallest numerator that is the smallest fraction. So here 2 by 5 is less than 4 by 5. B 6 by 9 is greater than 3 by 9. C 1 by 2 is less than 3 by 2. Next question. Then circle the like fractions. Here observe these fractions. Which fractions have same denominator are called like fractions. So 4 by 6, 2 by 6, 3 by 6, 1 by 6 and 5 by 6. These are like fractions. Next to be 3 by 18, 4 by 18, 5 by 8, 2 by 81, 6 by 8, 3 by 5, 3 by 8. Here also which fractions have same denominator those are like fractions so 4 by 8 5 by 8 6 by 8 and 3 by 8 so these are like fractions okay we will continue other topic with another video until then take care of you thank you bye bye